Aubrey Brow trying to sneak in behind. She was asking for the ball. And Merrimack again pumping forward as they look for the equalizer. Here goes Keo. Flag down. She's on side for now. Keo getting to the end line. Takes a shot and equalizes. It's Isabella Keo, the freshman's first career Merrimack goal. Head for Barbieri. Tried to slide it towards Stone, but kept away. Hey. Central Merrimack, a firing. AJ score! What a shot from Eve off the bottom of the crossbar and in from beyond the box. And Merrimack leads 2-1. Talk about a start for the Seahawks. Here, come, here comes Wiedemann. Sends it in toward Mariah. Loose ball in front. Morgan is able to grab it. And the next 545, this match comes to a close. Whatever the result may be. Murnane with the left foot up ahead for Keo. And now this time, it's Golden rolls in. Merrimack gets on the board.
Now some space in the middle. They will instead go far side to Sophia Ko. Sophia towards the goal. The header and a score. And we are tied right before halftime. That is a killer. A as great Merrimack play even there. Up. Where they have been sending it over. The specific team, the women's soccer team, they're the first team here at Lemoyne to win at Division I once the whole program went up to the highest level. As there is Molly Moraine towards the middle and a goal. And right out of the break, Merrimack takes the lead. And now a furious counterattack, three on two developing. Moraine towards the middle and goal number three for the Warriors. And that might have just been... It might be more shots and goals, or it's maybe their team's asking to do something from the defense. Oh, and there is goal number four. This time... They have went through these last few games. There's just a lot to take away from that they are capable of scoring. The Especially Dol versus one of the top teams. Yes, absolutely, Sydney. It's the Dolphins' first multi-goal game here at home as now the Warriors on the attack. That's Joe Mariello. She takes a shot, and now that's goal number five right off the fingertips of Allison Moreau. Off her fingertips. In this season, one minute left to go. And if you're Lemoyne, you just have to take every chance you can, try to start pushing the ball downfield, making the shots. But Merrimack now sending the ball downfield. It'll be another one-on-one. -on -one. And finally, Joe Marinello gets her breakaway goal. That had to be, what, her, her fourth breakaway? Good, 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 good. good. Keep going, Mo. Keep going, Mo. Good ball. We gotta talk. Come on. Rip. Oh. She's like, oh. What? Just under half between Merrimack and CCSU. Blue Devils right now at top of the NEC standings with 16 points. Here's Burgess against Christensen down the left side. And Morgan diving to her left makes the save. Hello. And Zarella crisscrossing around. Morgan got a piece of it. And another teasing ball. Got more Merrimack subs. And the CCSU team. Just under two minutes away now from picking up their eighth victory of the season. Here comes Sabrina Kraus. Kraus left foot at shot. Morgan with another good save. Was it? for a 1-0 lead she scores Jackson guessed left Cormier went right ball is live that went off the leg of Lancaster I believe looking the other way 
in the goal box. Jackson tries to go back to the near side to cover. It's a second too late, and Merrimack takes a 2-0 lead. The Warriors would be in line still to hold on to the two spot. Top six teams in the NEC make the conference tournament. Ball is deep inside the 18. Launched, shot, score. Merrimack grabs its third goal. Too much time inside the 18. She's on the sideline. He just hopes she'll be able to return at some point this season. Off the corner kick, Merrimack's got another. Warriors need one more goal to run their differential on the season to 20. Grace Casso swerves through. Casso near the six, fires and a save by Lily Morgan. What a save from Morgan. Sent in, back post. Morgan comes out, jumping and soaring through the air, makes the catch. Shot for Merrimack. That's in. Isabella Keo, freshman, getting involved in the party. Hard fought game so far. Missed opportunity. Here's Cormier. Empty net. They score. Tie ball game with just over eight minutes to go. Oviano in the midfield. Shot on, loose rebound, and it's in. Merrimack storms back down 2-0 to make it 3-2. And are now just a couple of moments away from a regular season championship. In the 66th minute. They've been able to climb all the way back with three second half goals. It's Jillian Golden in the 89th minute. And looking to add more. That's in. Unbelievable. For the Merrimack Warriors. Now up 4-2. What a turnaround. Ten seconds to go. Merrimack can feel it. Merrimack storms back. And they win the regular season championship in the Northeast Conference. As they mob their goalkeeper, Lily Morgan. And in his 40th season, Gabe Mahile, 40th year at Merrimack. 
can be crowned champion. Down 2-0 in the second half. Scored four straight to storm back and claim the number one seed in the NC, NEC tournament and win the NEC regular season championship by a final of four to two. Loft coming through, a touch, and it's in! The Warriors strike first. Isabella Keo with the finish. And Merrimack takes a 1-0 lead.